what does I want to do maybe also we will give a pet to save the hi everyone welcome back uh, in this video I want to start a new project which uh, the concept is about a recording screen in Ubuntu in Linux and uh, in first of all in this video I will show how to simply uh, getting the screen with OpenCV also and in the next video I will create the GUI so we can control the screen recorder with our GUI I will create some features in there so for GUI I will use QML so maybe uh, you will getting you will be getting more familiar with QML also because this will be second uh, project we are making with QML and the first project was the uh, sending video from C++ site to QML site and this will be second video including QML and in here first of all uh, for screen recording under this question this is almost uh, 8 years ago and uh, under this question there are some solutions they are all useful and just I am just copying this concept of code and when I copy it here you can see and this is couple of lines just and let me start running this code and you will see the uh, screen with uh, imshow with OpenCV okay let me start it okay you can see the screen in here this is basically just taking screen and showing with imshow uh, this is simple code uh, at the end with the GUI when the GUI is done also I will share all of the code in github so you can copy from there and uh, this video, this one, uh, I just copied from my GitHub. You can get that code from there. This is just including the the I mean this this project I'm talking about Ubuntu Screen Recorder. All of this in my GitHub. Uh, just I didn't change anywhere. Just couple of lines I changed. At all is same, and you can copy from send open CV to QML site. You can copy that code, and you can directly use. I just change the thread part which I'm similar to here just I just copied this out because uh, for this project we don't have any camera or any video stream we are directly getting the stream from the uh, Ubuntu screen site which with X lib X library uh, help and here is the C++ side of the project and I just change my if we compare with the previous QML send OpenCV to QML uh, video I just change here the, the timer I changed and I also couple of lines I added here and also this part I added and nothing else some of the lines I just commented and like that if we running uh, sorry this is the previous one let me change the project to this part okay this is belongs to the uh, first projects I shared in my channel and if you start the this one is just taking the screen and copying to QML site and nothing else is doing just that uh, so yeah as I said this project just copy from my github and just change these parts these parts and you can get the same results which I did what I forgot to tell you okay the X library I didn't talk uh, in here two libraries we are adding and we are getting the screen but how we are linking these libraries to Qt is very easy also uh, in the pro side in both side okay you are just adding one line which is lips plus equal to L X 11 you are adding this and the Qt is able to see these headers okay I think uh, for this video for I just want to start this project and how I will continue I wanted to tell you and in the next video most probably I will uh, adding some features to this QML and we will learn more about the QML site and what I want to add to this QML site I just want to add some features I mean the size of the window which size I wanna or maybe I will just select a ROI a region of interest I will say se uh, select and the 
this uh, this project will uh, this code will save only that region and what else I wanna do maybe also we will give a pet to save that recording and it will save to that directory our recorded video okay and this is very simple why I want to make this project because uh, in some cases maybe you need to record the screen okay there are many I mean there are many uh, recorder applications even in this video how I'm recording I'm using a recorder which is simple screen recorder in here you see the symbol of it and here is the uh, application I'm using oh, there are many kind of, but why people need can need this because in some cases you maybe you wanna make some processes on the screen uh, screen stream you need you can be need that for example in some cases I need it so some people also can need that that's why I wanna share this project okay then see you in the next in the next video for this video I'm done